Hey everyone, I hope everybody's doing well. Um, I wanted to talk about a game that meant a lot to me when I played it at the time, and I don't really think I got the chance to really go into depth about it when I did play it, but as you can tell, I like to play a lot of different games. I love games that tell a wonderful story, games that can immerse you into an experience that is unlike any other, and games that can change the way you think. This is how I feel about Firewatch. Firewatch takes place in the Wyoming wilderness, and its scenery is truly beautiful with the art style that the developers Campo Santo chose to use. The wilderness setting is both sincere and ominous, and it adds to Firewatch's overall atmosphere and sense of isolation. The day and night cycle, the weather effects, the lighting, all work together to create this sense of isolation and danger as we navigate through the wilderness in search of answers. Firewatch tells the story of Henry a man who takes up a summer job as a fire lookout after a series of difficult events in his own personal life have happened. And as we follow him through his own perspective, we come to see how rich and emotionally charged the exploration of Henry's character, his relationships, and the mysteries of the wilderness around him are. A reason I truly believe that this game is worth your time is discovering the game's narrative. The story is delivered through a series of conversations between Henry and his supervisor Delilah, whom he communicates with over radio the entire game. The writing of this story is exceptional, and the characters are so well developed and complex. The conversations between Henry and Delilah are both funny and personal, with plenty of witty banter and emotional moments that will keep you engaged throughout the entire game. Together, they uncover a mysterious conspiracy that threatens to unravel their peaceful experience in the wilderness. The story is full of twists and turns, and you'll find yourself invested in Henry's journey as he tries to make sense of the events unfolding around him. Now it's worth noting the themes that Firewatch's story deals with. And for those that are wondering, it definitely deals with grief, loss, and isolation. And the game's emotional impact is probably one of its strongest aspects. The story is not only well written, but it's also well acted, with powerful performances from the voice actors, the game's themes are universal and relatable, and you'll find yourself drawn into Henry's story and the world around him. Firewatch's emotional impact will linger long after you finish the game, leaving a truly long-lasting impression. As for the game's mechanics, Firewatch is primarily focused on exploration and conversation, with players navigating the wilderness and interacting with various objects and characters. You're basically challenged to just navigate through the entire park yourself. There's even some puzzles in Firewatch that are clever and challenging, but they're never really that frustrating or overly difficult. The game strikes a perfect balance between exploration, puzzle solving, and narrative, creating a cohesive and immersive experience for anyone playing. I chose to not go into too much detail with this video because I believe that Firewatch is a more impactful game to those who choose to experience it for themselves, and I didn't want to ruin that for others that haven't had a chance to play it yet. Just know that Firewatch is powerful and moving. And I found myself emotionally invested in the fate of Henry and Delilah as I kept playing. Firewatch has an ending that is memorable, and will stick with you long after you finish playing it. If any game can do that, I believe it's an experience that shouldn't be missed. I hope you've all been enjoying this series so far. As I said in the beginning, I love gaming. The sense of teleporting myself into a different world where I can explore my actions and emotions are some of my favorite moments. This game, like many others I plan to cover, is worth your time. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like. If not, leave a dislike. If you enjoy videos like this, though, and you want to see more, please consider subscribing. All right, everybody. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day or night, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care of yourself. See ya.